Baby corn fry without boss baby? I think it will, but let's find <laughs> convinces the board to lock me up in my office all day. I don't like it. What's his angle? Jimbo! Sorry! I ballooned myself, Rosie. You should eat. I'll order you something from the executive dining room. <gasps> executive dining room. Surely, monsieur, do not blame me here simply to watch the big one enjoy the nummy nums. No, I brought you here because I need information on OCB's schemes. And I happen to know he ate in your dining room today. <clears throat> I am a metal D, which means I value clash and most of all, this flashing. There's always something to value more. I need info. Name your price. Sometimes a lack of service can be without reward. Here comes the airplane. No, no, with gumption and more French. What does that mean? Mon baby Shelly, me dear down a petit avion. Tell me a curator from the barrage bush. Delicious. And now, dessert. Seriously? We just fed you like- Oh, it's a metaphor. The dessert is information. Proceed. Please, scoot back. You're about to be thrust to the edge of your high chairs. For you see, OCB has been slow roasting his plans. And at lunch, he served them piping hot and steaming. So, what are we noshing up? Today, we have the wiggly noodles. And may I recommend these flesh sauce? Oh, you may indeed. That boss baby, huh? Can't delegate, doesn't listen, and a CEO with a temper like that? Seriously. Best CEOs, dapper, charming, cool. Just like you! All I'm saying, I want to lose point. So baby cook, you are a noble businessman. A idea. Baby cook gets a new C-E-O. It's out there. We all heard it. Enjoy lunch. Talk later. <sighs> he's not a seagull manager. He's a bird of prey. And he's hunting my job. Uh-huh. Where are you going? I need to see the board. Why are you outside my office? OCB sent me. He said the board said you're not supposed to leave your office so that other employees can work. And if you do leave your office, it just proves you're a terrible CEO who doesn't want them to. What? I yeah. He's got me boxed in! Trick up our sleeves! Got him in the cough sleeves! <gasps> Diaper! It's looking real good, Stacy! Triplets, where are we on a name? This is more than just a 24-hour diaper. This is the 24-hour diaper. And that's why we call it the 24-hour diaper. That's the name we gave you. See? Very memorable. <laughs> OCB is not the dumb, handsome consultant we thought he was. I never said handsome. 
Happily, there's no way the board will replace me once I've delivered those 24-hour golden poop saddles. <laughs> oh, see, he's not gonna know what hit him. On my way to you now. For what? To carry this project over the finish line. Gotta move quick. I am moving quick. I'm gonna drop you a side move. I know I did, but now my job's riding on that diaper, Stace. OCB's up there charming the board against me. I can't just sit here doing nothing to stop that. You did do something. You hired me. And when that call comes, I will be there with a diaper that'll blow their butts off. All right? All right. <laughs> I'm just going to go check in on this. Oh, <laughs> Diaper invention's all done. Let's talk about a little idea I call meat gum. Done? Not yet. I know we got ourselves a solid 24 hour diaper, but let's paint it red, give it mufflers, take it off the diaper truck, and take it global. Because we're not here to blow away the competition, we're here to blow away the world. Yeah! Yeah! A 25 hour diaper! I'm sure we can think of something yes. better than that. Tracking to brag about your cooking, or are we doing the metaphor thing again? The chef must trust Le Soufflé to rise without looking, to be ready without checking, to be delicious without tasting. This is Le Soufflé in which your chippy hides, boss baby. Do you trust that it is not? So, bragging then. Metaphor! Let Stacy work! <coughs> I need this 